hi welcome again to our channel thank you for showing love to this channel i urge you to continue subscribing and watching our videos more thank you so today we are going to look at a very simple topic that's known as how to get your pin for a self-help group so i know it has been a hectic maybe sometimes to get this pin you end up paying so much more money to be able to get it since the process is a bit procedural but um, after watching this video, you are going to know how easy and efficiently you can be able to apply for this pin. So first things first is always to put the requirements in order. So number one, what will be needed of you is to have your group registration certificate. And uh, if the certificate has a period of more than one year, let it be renewed and stamped. Number two, you need to have typed minutes for the group. Uh, with a minute or a specific clause that is indicating you have intention to acquire a KRA pin. Number three, you need to have the scanned IDs of the group officials, and that is the chairperson, the treasurer, and the secretary. And lastly, you need to have uh, two scanned, uh, oh, sorry, you have the scanned KRAs for the officials, all of them. When you have already now put these uh, the three of these into order, now you can go to your browser and when you come to your browser, you can go now to the iTax portal here. So I'll go to home. On the iTax portal, you can go to where you have new uh, registration. You click there, then the taxpayer type you for the now because this is a group it's not a single individual we'll select an individual uh, the mode of registration so we put uh, an online form uh, because uh, we require it to be able to register here online then we click next so uh, these are the following things that you should note when you come to the business type eh, uh, we have the company, the non-government, so all those for a uh, uh, group, you select others. Then when we go to the business subtype, so you'll see somewhere written club, society, or association. That's where a self-help group follows. And then uh, you'll continue now to fill in the other details. That's the business registration number, the business name, that's the name of the group. So for the business registration number is the registration certificate number, basically. The business registration date, when was that business registered, when it commenced the accounting period. So all that should be able to, to fill all that those requirements on the basic uh, requirement part. Then when you move to the obligation part, a group falls under the income uh, tax company. So you select the income tax company. And put the exact date uh, where you are or when you are uh, you you will be um, applying the exact day and uh, thirdly we go to the price written directors so when you come to here where we have directors we have uh, the first question here is the nature of association so uh, I said the group falls under the part of companies so you can see there is a business associate, the director, partner. But because you are dealing with a group, you just select others. And maybe on the part written, other, if I want to include the details of chairperson, I just write chairperson. Then uh, I'll be able to input. Remember I said you must have the pins of the uh, register of, of the person. Who is uh, applying for the oh, sorry of the officials who are applying for the pin? Eh? So I'd be able to put an uh, a pin for the official. Maybe just a dummy one. If I put for example that one, uh -huh. one is not good. Maybe just use my. So if I input the details, see all the details are the, my details are all refilled. So if I want now to input the second person, let me assume I was the chairperson. So I'll just come to the place written and 
If you click on that, the details of the person you have viewed, you can see them. They are written down here on number one. Eh? So you'll be able now to come select the nature of association again and you put other. Maybe now I want to put the details of the secretary. So I'll write secretary. Uh, go ahead to fill in the, the, the details or the fin of the secretary and the other details out of a curate. Then I'll do the same for the for the chairperson. Eh? And when I do all that, all those details are complete. I'll be able now not to get a pin immediately. When I finish the process here, you'll not get a pin immediately, but you'll be able to get what we call the acknowledgement receipt. So with when you get an acknowledgement receipt, there are two ways. Number one, um, you can be told to wait until they produce KR thing, but the most probable way you might be told to visit uh, maybe the nearest KRA offices near you to get that pin. So to avoid all that hassle, this is the, this is the second part of uh, what you should do. Uh, so after you get all those these requirements that you had talked about in order, now you have the group registration certificate, the type the minutes, scanned uh, IDs, then scanned KRA of the officials. You need now to also add uh, the acknowledgement receipt. You, uh, you scan the acknowledgement receipt that you had. Then you come and send those documents to this email. KRA has a special email that is used to serve people. It's called call center at KRA. Sorry, there is something that is missing here. So it should be at kra.go so there should be a dot before geo at kra.go.ke so you draft an email uh, whereby you say you have applied for the company or uh, for the self help group pin and uh, you attach all those documents that are supposed to be attached that is the type the minutes uh, the ids of the of the chairperson, the secretary, and the treasurer, the uh, KRA pins also, and also the acknowledgement receipt. After that, KRA will be sending you an email uh, that uh, they have received your application. And sooner or later, maybe between one to three days, you'll be able to get your self help group certificate through that email. So thank you so much for today. For those who have not yet subscribed, continue learning more. Just subscribe to our channel. We hope to see you uh, next time. Thank you so much.